So we get to G7. They're losing connectivity or there's accuracy issues and they just, they can't wear it. So what what is this issue? Um, how do you quantify it? What's Dexcom's kind of opinion, approach and all that to it? You're producing a ton of these things. You you bring in parts from a lot of different companies and, and at some point, some of them were defective and a bunch of sensors got out into the world. Is the problem fixed or will pe people still be experiencing connectivity issues? Stuff it's like a good that. question. So 4 million sensors are, are used in a week and growing, and that doesn't even include the Stello. Uh, we are getting through it very quickly. Um, and, you know, CGM technology is not perfect, and we know that. Uh, every iteration of the technology we work to make it better. And so people uh, can still have issues, and the goal is to make sure if they do run into an issue that we've got the technology to replace it. But our focus right now is making sure we know everything that people are running into and that we're on top of resolving it. Um, and then the other thing too, I think that we've also learned when they have an issue, um, you know, how our tech support talks to users and manages that and makes sure that they have a great experience. And if they need a replacement, they get the replacement and they get it in the time frame. And I think we've made some mistakes in the way that we rolled out uh, some of the support policies and we learned a ton from that. And so one of the things I want you know users to know is that we will replace any sensor that doesn't work for you. There's no limit, there's no cap on those. Uh, and the um, and if you need a sensor overnight, we're gonna ship it overnight. 